So you saw the video a couple days ago that wasn't very good. And you kind of heard our little spiel about liquidation game changing. And But we'll try again because we have a few boxes left still from this company because always trying to find new places to buy from and we're actively trying to find new companies to buy from while we work through the rest of our back stock of liquidation box we currently have. So let's try again. 250 bucks, GM box. Could be good, it could be bad. Hopefully it's better than the one on Tuesday. But like you saw, the liquidation game is not all apples and roses. Sometimes it can be pears and rotten grapes. Hey, I like pears. Not when it comes with the rotten grapes you don't. <laughs> yeah. 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 Little peak. That's what you got. Let's let's hope for the best. Okay. We're gonna hope for the best. So I mean it is kinda nice, you know, like some channels that you watch, I'm not too sure there's any there's really not, not a whole lot left, but you know, it just show like the good the good parts of this like you're seeing like the struggle that we're going through trying to find a, a good supplier right now where you at home if you're trying to, to do the same thing we feel your pain because you're feeling our pain <laughs> not all liquidation companies are created equal no no and some are created equal but then go downhill correct i have a dog training collar yep same thing junk <laughs> Pass. I have Saw, the movie. We have like four of those now, I think, um, right? I think I only have like one or two left. We had a whole bunch of Yeah, we did, but they've been selling, so. I think we just have just that one. Seven, seven. So it's only seven bucks? Yeah. Brand new Fire Seal 4K yeah. Ultra HD? Seven bucks. E. Tennis balls, brand new. It'll be listed that very stinks. soon. It probably won't last long, though. No. For seven. But, I mean, we, we sold it like a month apart from each other, too. So, it must not be like a super fast sell. No, they're not super. But it is close to Halloween, so. Get it up quick. Maybe. Yeah. It might sell for like $7.50. We'll see. This is a smart watch. A car recorder thing. Uh, dash no, cam. Dash cam. Another dog training collar. We have like 400 dog training collars. This is a toothbrush sterilizer. I bet it doesn't work. It doesn't actually, you know. Don't know. You know what I'm saying? Kind of like the uh, CPAP machine. Like they have this thing that they can buy now that you put your CPAP like mask in in the morning and it like sterilizes your mask and tubing. But there's been some research done and it doesn't actually do anything. It's just all like it makes you think that it's sterilizing your mask and tubing all throughout the day. But it doesn't actually do anything. Who says it doesn't do anything? The research people who did the research, research on people? the internet. I don't remember. Yeah. Walkie talkies. <laughs> we have the support dog brand. I think this is the one that's really expensive, isn't I think it? That one sells pretty well. What's that um, brand? It's, it's called Sport Dog. Have we sold it? I think we've sold similar items. Yeah, here's you have one listed for twenty five bucks. For but that parts. one's four parts. You have one that's listed for twenty five. Okay. Well, we've that one's four parts, so we'll have and to a, test another this one. dog thing. Ugh. And another, another dog, dog thing. thing. This Ugh. is the dog box, apparently. This is kind of nice, though. Convenient cordless shaver. Get that Maybe to you. I should keep this too. I'll get that Ooh. To you. Nice. We have air compression leg massagers again. Ooh, I'm going to keep this. Well, just hold your pretty pants because here comes another one that you might like even better. That's not even used. Oh, oh what's that? That one has like a self-cleaning thing. Like you, is it in here? Wow. Oh, good. It is in here. Convenient oh, cordless shave. It needs to be charged. Something fierce. Is that a good one? Wow, look at the head on that thing. That thing looks scary. <laughs> sure that's the uh, that sounds so strange wow look at the head on that thing yeah, it looks scary it's like a zit or something wow <laughs> i kind of want to try this thing out it looks awesome too look look how that like it flexes so as it goes like let's say like, on your head it's it's, it's going and like flex so and you stuff. put it in this thingy and then it like washes it oh no 
What do you mean, oh no? Like, oh no, like, I probably need to keep it now. Oh. You are not... It hasn't even been used yet. Like, your reactions are not matching your, uh... <laughs> what you mean today. It's like, oh no. It's like, no, that's like a good oh no. Obviously. Obviously. Happy Halloween. Like I'm supposed to know these things. Wow, this thing's kind of... I'm always in, in the mood to like get like a new head tremor for my head. Did you just... You just kept one out of another palette not too long ago. As a backup to one I currently have. Right. And I might... So how many backups do I we might need? Be, I might be upgrading again. Because I'll tell you what, I don't think this this palette is going... Or this box is going to be very profitable. I don't know. We'll have to find... I think it's like 20 bucks used. Or oh. opened up. It's pretty cheap. Well, he won't want it then because it's not expensive. I kind of want to look, look at this one. <laughs> Bronze Series 7. If it's not expensive, bougie, bo bougie boy over here doesn't want it. Who are you talking about? Bougie boy. Who's that? Who's bougie boy? His name happens to be Clint Miller. Franchise Kicks. You think I'm the bad, bougie? The bad guy. You think I'm bougie? Ooh, yeah, I might keep this. I might have to watch some YouTube videos on this and see like how well it works. This might be I very... don't think it's intended for like shave your head though. Oh, it's not. Adjust to personal skin type and shaving style. Shaving style, like this. <laughs> like this. Yeah. Wet and dry. Read and adapts. It read and adapts to your beard. Wow. So it would read to and adapt to my head then. What does it mean? Read. I don't know. What does that mean? <laughs> sounds pretty it's, serious. It sounds like fancy words that don't mean a whole lot. It reads and adapts. What we're does that mean? we're in the age of robots now. So it looks like this would sell for maybe eighty to a hundred. If it was new, it'd be like one seventy five. Oh, well, there's the value of the box right there. <laughs> and I might be keeping it. I don't know if I'll keep that one. That's not really made for your head, though, right? We have two Otterbox cases of which will Ooh, not be listed. This. That is a knife. Urgh. Why is the? You probably have to be smarter than the knife holder. The knife is stuck. Would you like me to unstuck it? <laughs> Stuck it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's the knife. <laughs> What's the point of this? It's like a plastic handle. Huh. Condor. Here, you look, look down. Oh, well, I talk about this one. Recon Tanto. This one's one that looks kind of intriguing. Is oh, it's still factory. Can't open it up. It's still factory seal. Wah, wah. So I'm just looking on Amazon for new. That looks really cool. It's almost like a mini, like a a samurai sword, but it sells new for forty five bucks. The Recon Tanto SK Dash Five Steel. That's kind of awesome. I don't have anything like this. I don't. I actually need it though. Maybe I do. Nah, I don't really need it that much. It could have still factory seal. If it was opened up, maybe I might hold on to it, but 45. We went to a really cool knife store not too long ago. We were down in Gatlinburg. Gatlinburg, And Tennessee. shout out to the person who said hello to us in the grocery oh, store. Oh, yeah. Don't we're, know what your name was, but thanks for saying we were hi. We at a Publix in Pigeon Tra Forge, Kroger. Tennessee. Kroger, Kroger and, and yeah. Pigeon Forge, Tennessee, walking around. We were on like a family trip last week, and uh, yeah, we had husband, wife, and maybe a couple kids, I think. Yeah. Because the kids, they recognized us or something like that. Yeah, I think I heard the one, the one, I think <laughs> it was the girl. daughter, and she was like, I told you that was them. <laughs> <laughs> it was kind of funny. Yeah. Um, but yeah, that was really cool. And. On our great expedition, we saw four baby cubs and a mama bear. A big old bear. Like, straight up, we were like, oh, I mean, just, they were up the hill and we were down the hill and they were... They were staring at us. They were. We were going to play hillbilly golf, which was totally In fun. Gatlinburg, Tennessee. It was so much fun. If you guys go to Gatlinburg ever... Go play hillbilly golf because you'll it was see bears so too fun on the putt putt course. Yeah, they actually had to shut it down and like chase the bears off because it wasn't safe because the mama bear was very aggressive 
and so they had to like close down a pup up course and we all of course we all had our cameras out on pointing it's like oh there they are and, i got yeah. some really good photos really though good. yeah maybe you can add one to the video maybe. here and i'm having i'm on the struggle bus with this ah found it it's like 45 dollars for this orange knife that's a whole lot of work for 45 dollars yeah but it's still a decent money though like it it, it it will sell i'll give you this we only have two things left and one we can't show oh from hell i haven't seen this for a long time remember this, when this came out no nope. 2001 that's Never a young it. Johnny Depp, yeah. pre-Amber Heard that screwed his life up. We're Team Johnny Depp, not Team Amber Heard. Team Johnny Depp. Team Johnny Depp. My daughter used to love Johnny Depp. Maybe she still does. I, I love don't Johnny know. Depp. He's like my hero. She loved Edward Scissorhands. I like Captain <laughs> Jack Sparrow. <laughs> I never cared for an Edward Scissorhands movie. I didn't, I thought, I didn't think it was very good. So we have a... Captain Jack Sparrow. We have a kapow bang bang in okay. here that we cannot show. It's an airsoft. And then we have this... We've had that before. Stove thing. Thing. Portable dual fuel stove. Yes. Stove. Looks so used. It does look used. It will not be shipped because uh -uh. if it has had yes. fuel in it in the past... It cannot be shipped. Well, well if it, it has, can, but you got to put all these warnings on yeah, it and labels. Has and to be there's like only certain special carriers and, who will yeah. ship it. Like you can't ship it USPS. And Total pain in the butt. It's a pain in the butt for an item that's like 30 bucks or something. Yeah. So it's just sold locally. Locally. Yeah. For ease. Yes. Ease. Ease. So that is it for this one. I think it was a little bit better. I think it was a little bit better. I mean, the bronze like 80 bucks. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure that these are fairly... The one that we had for 25 was for parts not working. Correct. So that has to be for at least double that then. I would think to 100, so. I yeah, bet. I would think so. But I think this actually was a little bit better than a couple days ago when we went on a little tangent about the liquidation business. Yes. For like had, five, six, eight minutes. We had our boohoo moment. Our our bougie moment of not bougie. bouginess. Not bougie. Boohoo. Boo bougie. Boohoo. Boohoo bougie. Like wine wine. Yup. <laughs> That's it. That was awkward. <laughs> We're done. <laughs> All right, bye. Step one, wake up early, gonna rise with the sun. Step two, get some good, some food in you. Step three, you grow hard about what you wanna be. Step four, fuck everybody, just do your thing. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day.